What a brilliant day we had yesterday on the boat. Absolutely phenomenal going down the Delta system here in Dalian. Well, we're trying to go to see the famous Captain June's Turtle Rescue Centre today. Kids have just gone off for a massage. And I think there's nothing better to start your day than an early morning swim. <coughs> and get us down to Turtle Beach by the Caressa Caressa Hospital and check it out Yep, we got a pretty packed bus this morning The <laughs> bus is quite full sometimes and you have to sit on the floor Us off the bus, nice little ride, bit pretty crammed in like sardines. Can you believe they got 200 people on that bus? We only came for the first time ever in all the years coming here last year for the first time here. Didn't really, we always took the boat. So, this is Captain June's hut. Yeah, everyone's seen this, who are doing research, but it's about a two minute walk from being dropped off. I came to Turkey on my oh. boat in 75 and they'd never seen a woman skipper, yacht owner, but this was the turtle and I watched her. I lay down on the sand in the darkness and I watched her make her nest and lay her eggs and then I watched her close up the nest and smooth it so that nobody would know what had been there and then she went back to the sea. This was a very moving experience. It was the primeval message of continuation of the species and of devotion. Devotion to duty, that would think. I heard about development coming, a road all the way along the beach, and a yacht marina where the uh, the whole island is and a um, couple of hotels at either end and I thought what's going to happen to these turtles how are they going to come here in the night if they've got cars driving along the beach I know enough about the environment and animals to know that this is devastating and so slowly slowly as more tourists began to come then not a lot but some I gathered signatures and when I went away in the winter and told people the stories, showed them pictures of the beach, quite a few of those signed as well. Oh no, let's not ruin that beach. Let the creatures come and lay their eggs. End of 86, we were thrown off the beach. 
all of us. Every hut had to be demolished, removed. Well, that's when I thought we couldn't possibly win, when I saw 300 people having lunch on the beach, all wealthy, all dressed up, bulldozers and earth movers on the beach. You'll read all about it in my book. This one sadly has lost a leg. Was very big, yeah. Wow. And uh, control, we have to control it because uh, we take some um, some hey. numbers. Hey. Uh, hey. Yeah, yeah. How do you how do you know where the turtles huh. have laid the eggs to uh, put your square frame? We found footprints. Uh. We observe that and. Um, is there any hole yes. in sand? We uh, checked it. Are there any uh, eggs here? And this is done so in the night time. We protect with the yeah. 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 So this t now the hatching. Yeah, yeah. yeah. brilliant. So we've got the biggest male. So only male. And the only male. So it's only females that get injured mainly. Uh, females are came uh, for nests. Yes. So uh, males are. Yeah. Is it mainly fishing hooks? Uh, yes. 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 And yeah, yeah. Who even knew there's so many turtles? Coretta Coretta, the loggerhead turtle. The green turtle, the leatherback turtle. We have the hawks bill, Kent Riley, black, olive, and a flat back turtle. Look at the beach in its day there, just a few tents. On the far end of Dalian Beach here, uh, the Captain June and the Turtle Sanctuary end, well worth a visit. There's the gang going in the sea. I don't know, it's something to do with I don't want to be associated. Yeah, of course I can. Yeah, absolutely. That's the whole idea of bringing this in. So what do, you, what do you do after a hot day down the beach when you get back into the Dalian? That's right, you find a bar and you have a couple of beers. I'll have an Ephes, please. Orange juice for Kelly, the traditional tea for me. Oh, that's fresh orange juice. Oh, the cheese tomato, cucumbers, fantastic. I like the meat olives, a little bit of a tapenade. The grilled olives. 
you're not expecting to eat all this. Kel's favourite, the honey from yesterday. That's chocolate spread. Chocolate spread, yeah. Rose jam, strawberry jam. Oh my god. Bread. I I have I have right. Can so I well, I've got Enjoy. the um, Turkish soup, and I think this is a great stop if you're coming up to the beach and you haven't had breakfast like us. You don't need lunch after this either. I've got the um, sausage and eggs, and it is just beautiful. And for those who like English breakfast, they do do a, a style of English breakfast here. But look at this for the spread. Oh my god. Terry. Sausage. You've got chocolate, hazelnut, all down your t shirt. Kelly, what's you just done now? He's just brought us in fried eggs, mushrooms. More fried and eggs. And sausages. Mush and the mushrooms, I don't know, I've never tasted mushrooms cooked like it. We've got chili. Oh my god. This food's excellent. <laughs> Why are we the only ones here? And the view, the food, this is a no brainer. Well, the food keeps on coming. We don't, we haven't ordered this. We have, this is the sprinkling breakfast. Menemen. Oh, the sprinkling, this is the, this has got to be the best breakfast ever. We have barrack and, and chips and pancake and soup and mushrooms. Oh my god! We had a very like evening meal last night, so we came pretty hungry here. Yeah. Um, but I'm afraid it's defeated us. Too much food. Far too much food. Yeah, we ordered well probably was enough for four. <laughs> Easy. So um, if you are coming and you're trying this out. Uh, we ordered the um, spring, yeah, sprinkling breakfast, which is everything, and it's definitely don't need anything else with it. So, from Turkey, Geo. Well, we've we've got down to the beach. Thank God we didn't walk it. It's quite a trek, but we're going to try and walk the whole length of it to beach. Uh, we've adequately fueled. We're going to do it on the shoreline. Uh, let's see how we get on. Fifty-three. Let's see what time we get down to where the taxi boats are. These holes in the sand, they say they're for turtles. Let's be careful. See no nesting eggs. So, don't know why. Looks perfectly safe to me. I suppose that you can always get caught in a rip current. Stick to local advice. Oh, wow. Three of them. All hunting. And they've 
There's four of them now. Off they go. Just following them. There goes that fallen tree. So refreshing to see no litter whatsoever. Um, the debris that's washed up here is grass reeds that are built into the delta system. So absolute not even, I haven't even seen a, a single bottle, a bit of plastic, yeah the odd bit of fishing lines in there. You're always gonna get that but 10 out of 10 for cleanliness. Absolutely superb. What's that? Uh, wow. So yeah, well done Turkey. Your beaches are amazing. Well, we found our first bit of plastic. And we are doing our bit. We'll leave that if it doesn't go in the ocean. Kelly's taking it to the turtle cages and hopefully one of the rangers will dispose of it. Thirds of the way down now. There's the heli bit. There's the lake where we had breakfast. Just tucked around the corner there. And we've got to go about another third of the way. And we're doing well. We're doing really, really well. Isn't it? you walk that just doesn't seem to be getting any closer does it <laughs> well we're in the final stretches now we can almost touch the huts the one downside of doing this now there's no beers we don't sell beers it's a government run building so it's only soft drinks but I could definitely do a beer after this. Well, right, we finally reached the very outskirts of the sunbeds. That does feel an achievement. We're going to carry on going to the channel. Well, it's not, but I, I think it's only right. We've done the whole length, we've got to see it through, and then we can cut up to the beach. Well, Kelly's off. I'm going to try and get to the end here and uh, record the time. Well, it's the uh, last few, probably last hundred metres now, and uh, Kelly's gone for the sunbed. She thinks she's gone far enough. Well, if you want to do these things, And that, my friends, is the length of the beach here at Dalian. Ah, so we're getting shown on the boat. There's the turtle. Oh, what the size of that boy! He's a big boy, isn't he? Hey. Yeah, they're all coming up for air. Amazing. Look, he's coming up, Terry. So just be patient. There, look, 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 watch. Yeah. There's two, there's two together. together. He's going under the boat. He's <laughs> right, it's deep. He's, he's going deep. He's turned. They don't stay under the water for very long, do they? They come up quite a lot, don't they? It's too deep to get on camera, that. Yeah. 